Hello and welcome to the Ninja Trader Indicator Warehouse. Today we're going to cover the Bollinger Band trailing stop. So uh, we recently did a video on the Bollinger Band histogram squeeze and I thought in the spirit of uh, Bollinger we would just keep moving down that line. So this is a very interesting indicator. Let's have a quick look at it. It uses the same parameters as a Typical Bollinger Band, you can see two standard deviations set with a 14 period. Uh, you can control the uh, wave alerts or wave files that uh, go off when the direction changes. And you can also control um, the trailing stop, the color of the dots. I like to always have green when I'm long, so I'm just going to change that. Right okay, so we can see just uh, immediately here, there was a little short uh, up move here, and it, it caught it. And now um, one of the beautiful things about a Bollinger Band is you pretty much are always in the market if you want to be. And so you can see we're now uh, riding down a short wave. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open up uh, the regular indicators and add a standard Bollinger Band to the chart so you can see how this uh, trailing stop is constructed. So notice what it's doing here. It's actually riding the top band down. And let's just watch it for a little bit. Okay, let's go ahead and take the uh, standard Bollinger off because I find it a bit distracting. Notice how this is keeping you in the move. Um, I don't know about you, but I may have chickened out by now. And uh, I would have left money on the table. So it does a really good job of uh, using the proven methodology of Bollinger uh, to run a nice trailing stop. So look at that nice long move that it captured. Very, uh, very innovative in my opinion. So with that, uh, I'd like you to remember that whether you are day trading the E-mini S&P, other futures contracts, or Forex, Indicator Warehouse will help you get more profit from your online trading and technical analysis efforts. Thank you for joining us today.